Okay, sorry, the phone shuts off, so I need to start again. So, um, so this is almost new bow, but still you can see this small gap and and the gap is mostly due because the, the wood has bent a bit, but still uh, now you have to ask yourself, do I need to do something about it? And if the, the, uh, the frog is sitting very well on the stick, if it doesn't wobble, then you don't have to do anything about it and it's normal, it's within parameters. It's, uh, it does not, the stick does not move, it's just that it has adjusted a bit uh, further from the ideal completely straight part, but it's still fitting perfectly well. If I unscrew this... Um, maybe we can see there is a ever slight... Well, not really, it doesn't really move, but uh, what really is happening is that those parts, they are a bit bent due to wear and look, I, I mentioned sweat, um, well this is like sweat going into the, um, into the stick and that causes this change in the, um, uh, in the parameter of the bow. Uh, let's take another example with a, an older bow, uh, which is also a French bow. And it's also, if I tighten it up, um, maybe you can see there is also a never slight tiny gap there. And again, it's nothing to worry about. The stick is perfectly sitting on the on the on the bow. And if I unscrew it, you can. Uh, I'm sure we can see that some kind of wear. And yeah, you can see a bit of oxidation. And also on the stick. So the parameters of the bow are changing and also this bit, uh, you can see it's wobbling slightly and this is, this is, this is allowing the stick to, to still stick to the stick while not being perfectly um, parallel or perpendicular. Uh, when this goes really really wide, and, but I mean a, a lot more than this, then uh, you might consider um, doing some restoration on the bow. So that happened with older bow or bow that, that I've played a lot. And the way we do that is to... Um, let's try to, to show you what's difficult. Yeah. It's to fill this hole, to fill the hole that's inside there, and to drill something that's less big. Obviously we won't do that for this one because it's still perfectly within parameter, but when it's gaining really big and you have like, it's sticking out from, I don't know, two millimeters or one millimeter and a half, then uh, maybe one millimeter, then you might want to try to do this. Although the, really the, what you need to consider is, is the, the frog sitting still on the stick? when tight and well it might wobble a slightly bit but on both that need to be repaired this will be um, I need to untie it otherwise it won't show maybe like it will be like wobbling a lot and this you consider doing the repair so I hope this was more um, helpful for you to understand please uh, do not hesitate to contact me if you have more questions um, bye bye for now